So let's have a look at this circuit using operational amplifier. What you see on your screen is uh, op amp with the positive and the negative inputs. To the positive inputs, we are connecting an input signal, external input signal labeled as OE in, and the output of the op amp is connected to a diode as shown and the output is taken from this terminal and there is a capacitor also connected with respect to ground and there is this switch just to reset the potential or voltage across the capacitor after it gets charged so let's explain how this circuit will work so imagine you have a time varying signal at the input whether it is a pure sine wave or a signal with arbitrary amplitudes variations with respect to time so when the signal is applied at the positive terminal and it is a positive going signal you have a positive potential polarity at the output that makes this diode forward bias and this charges the capacitor with the polarity as shown at the same time with the diode forward biasing this voltage is fed back a portion of this voltage is fed back to the inverting terminal of the op amp so essentially this circuit acts as a voltage follower with the gain of the amplifier so output would be gain times the input so you say that uh, the input voltage whatever the input voltage is there that comes at the output because it's a voltage follower and this voltage charges the capacitor to the full value and this process continues when the input signal falls then there is a negative voltage at the output of the amplifier that reverse biases the diode and the diode is open circuited and you don't have any feedback going to the input negative input of the op amp so in that in that condition capacitor holds a charge the previously stored charge on its two terminals again when your input goes starts increasing and it has a positive going signal positive comes here and the diode gets forward bias and it charges the capacitor so you see with the variations of the input your capacitor is getting charged for the positive rising values of the input and for the falling negative values of the input capacitor is maintaining that charge unless and until your input rises again so this output voltage is essentially tracking the peak value of the input and the circuit is called as peak detector so this is how simple op amp can be configured as a peak detector circuit and this switch here is just to reset the capacitor voltage 